Hey everyone! We haven't streamed path in a while. Actually, wait a minute. I have some delirious maps. Play some of these delirious maps. Okay. Oh, it's a devourer, that's why. Red beast. Well. Ooh! Two more delirious maps, nice. So, I managed to hit 95 now. I'm still working on the whole 96 thing. I've been making heavy use of the Tomans of Amelioration. Are if you die, you only lose 25% of the XP you otherwise would. Uh, or, in other words, it, you uh, will lose 2.5% experience when you die, instead of losing 10%. Which is... Absolutely worth the 45 chaos I've been paying. How have you been enjoying this league so far? I've been enjoying the league well. Honestly, uh, it's been it's been quite good with uh, some of the changes it's had. Um, I enjoy this character, and I've been enjoying the play style and playing, enjoying working on the path of building. But that's the part of the league I enjoy. The mechanic of the league, I have basically no interest in playing. Like, it's not bad. It's enjoyable. But, like, the rewards do not match the time investment. Like, I can do a full map in the time that it takes to do a match, and or more than a map, and I can get way more money out of that. If you do better, you obviously get better rewards, but, like, your fifth game you win isn't more rewarding than first game you win. So, like just haven't seen a good reason to play it when, like, the rewards are subpar. But, yeah, the, the short answer is yes, I'm enjoying the league. Uh, no, I do not give a shit about the mechanic. Uh, honestly, I enjoyed Crucible a lot more in that sense. If I could bring home, like, a reliable maybe, like, 5 chaos per match, at least, I would be fine with it, because, like, that's what I can reliably bring back from most maps. But... The average winnings is really low from what I've seen. I'll just do a fast map here. I mean, it has no quality on it, so it's not really going to be amazing. But, I mean, it's a delirious map, so it's still kind of worth doing. I'm not going to do it for very long, but I'm going to do it. I really like the Firestorm Mines. They're quite fun. And I have a plus four chest plate, like plus four gem to my uh, Firestorm, so... It's pretty nice, and I just got a level 21 Anomalous Firestorm today. Level 21 20 Anomalous Firestorm, so I have a 25 20. I, I corrupted the 20 20 to a 21 20, and this gem is worth 10 div, which is the same value as my entire bank. So that was really lucky because I wasn't going to have that for a while. Hi Lunaris, hi Solaris, goodbye. There's Solaris, and it's... Cool. God, Ritual is such a weird league. Because, like, whatever you kill uh, in, like, that circle comes back when you start the Ritual. And whatever you kill in your next Ritual gets both what you killed in this one and the next one. So it actually was advantageous to run to the, bo the boss room past everything, kill the boss in the circle, then backtrack. Which is a weird gameplay loop to incentivize, I feel like. Ah, oh, it's nice to play some chill path. It occurs to me that it probably doesn't look very chill on screen. <laughs> But this level of challenge doesn't really bother me, seeing as it's low tier. So I kind of know I'm not going to die. Yeah, so I bought 3,400 tokens back from that map. That means I made a little over... made about 10 or 11 chaos just on that. I can't even begin to... to I can't even begin to make the uh, League Mechanic worth that much money, and that's not even much money. Oh, there's a little thing! Oh, there's a little thing in the, in the right bottom right-hand corner now! If you have an incubator on something, that's awesome! Oh my gosh, that makes it so much easier. I don't have to check every single fucking thing to see whether it has an incubator or not. 
Yeah, I've already made more in this map than I can reliably make from the League Mechanic in a match. And this is... N the time is incomparable between those two. Because I think, like, weird football, hockey, soccer, whatever, is kind of cool. Like, it's really kind of cool thematically, honestly. Like, you're basically in Valhalla with, like, all the major, like, generals and warlords that have ever lived with their own factions all, like, trying to, like, because this is, like, their promised afterlife. Like, that, is a, that is a really cool concept. And, like, being able to see, like, King Combe again after murdering him in the uh, story... And, like, be able to t actually have a conversation with him, because, like, you never actually get to speak to him before that point. That, it's it's a pretty cool mechanic idea, at least thematically. I think my interest actually started dying in the mechanic when I realized that there's no... That, like, stun-resistant like stun resistant or stun-immune builds had no benefit in the mechanic, like, when doing stuff. Despite the fact that, well, like, one of the main issues in it is that you can get stunned. Stun immunity, like, making a character for the mechanic itself would be amazing. Like, that's a thing that would be really fun to do. I don't know, I, I feel like being able to go for, like, stun immune characters would be... I feel like that being able to, like, pick a stun immune character and, like, really, uh, like, gear yourself towards the particular mechanic, I think that's, like, a really fun way to do things. Just makes me kind of sad, because, like, you could totally make a character that is completely stun immune and doesn't die, but doesn't deal damage. And like, that would totally have been cool. I'm like constantly trying to find a way or a game mode where I can like advantageously farm with a zero DPS character. I don't know why. Oh my gosh, especially if you could aura bot like for your team and just like follow them around and make them like super strong. I wish they would encourage more build types, just like make something interesting about playing like an aura bot or like help make more characters that can work with other characters better like they're always talking about like oh we can't have an auction house because we want player interaction well give players a reason to interact like if everyone's playing like the same set of builds they probably have the best aura they have so like if you play with another dps character with their one maybe two auras you either have them or you don't benefit from them so I totally realized something a little bit earlier during our break. I never actually put out any, like, messages or notices that I usually would to be like, Hey, I'm streaming! So, like, I never actually told anyone. <laughs> I just streamed at the normal time, because, like, I was, like, rushing around trying to, like, get a video out, and I did not fucking remember to send out messages like I usually would. Like, I tried to send it out a few hours in advance, but, like, nope, it didn't happen. Which I believe means that I cast faster in this build. Oh god. Ow. Oh no. They always cast through the door and just like absolutely destroy you. Oh no. Oh no, I don't like that. Oh, ho. oh I barely got out of that. <laughs> okay, I'm pretty sure I still haven't killed the boss here. Feel free to remind me if you remember. <laughs> My memory ain't so good these days. You are going to be happy if you subscribe to my Patreon, which I'm almost done making, because I am going to be doing some voice acting of some dating sims, and I've already recorded some of it, and it is great. Yeah, I did like two hours of voice acting with a special guest yesterday, and it turned out very differently than I expected, and... Honestly, I would not replace it for anything that I could else otherwise make. It was it turned out really good. So, I look forward to putting that up on the Patreon. Unfortunately, though, it can't go on YouTube or Twitch. Reasons that you'll understand when you see it. In any case, my Patreon will be up soon. I intend to be putting out... I don't really have a frequency yet, but I intend to be putting out exclusive content for it semi-regularly. As well as, like, on the channel as normal. You'll be able to see everything uh, when I finish making it. If I make something a week early, you'll get to see it a week early. It'll always be uploaded on Patreon first, and then on the YouTube channel. Get exclusive content. Well. So, I'm going to be streaming on Twitch, making exclusive content for Patreon, 
and uploading on YouTube five times a week. That's the plan. Oh my gosh, where the heck are you going, Abyss? Hey, double back on me! Rude. What back here? In the meantime, there's just like really, really chill music suddenly. Just like, oh, you're, you're relaxing under a waterfall. There isn't things trying to cut off your head with scythes. I'm gonna give it like a second to spawn things. Like, no, give me, give me more stuff. I need more progress. Is there a point when these portals stop spawning stuff? I've never, like, tested that. I've never tried to not kill them before. Gotta carefully do this slightly away from the portal so it doesn't come up. I think this is actually working. That's really silly. Eh! No, the portal's on fire! I didn't mean to do that! Ah, whatever. This is waiting way too long. Funny, but it's taking way too long. Okay, can I, like... No, I need, like, just a tiny, tiny bit more. Uh, wait! Hold on a second. There's an essence right here. Let's go the essence. Whoa, lots of things happening. Oh, I killed these things. Come on, give me give me tier 7. Come on. Come on. Come on, you know you want to. Whatever. I tried. Oh, actually. Wait, no, I'll get to, I think I'll actually get to tier 8 now if I do this. Or wait, if it spawns the boss again, do I get, can I get progress again? Can I like kill it for like another reward tier? I don't know if I can. Is that it right there? Yes, that's it. No, didn't work. Ah. Uh, for like the past five hours now. So, making it editing. So, I'm gonna... I'm gonna call it here a little bit early. Uh... Yeah, I'm gonna call it a bit early. My brain is so shot. Like, I was, like, trying to come up with basic speech. <laughs> uh, thank you all for coming today, though. Those of you that managed to do so without me, like... Notifying anyone. <laughs> so, to everyone who's here and has been here, I really appreciate it. Really appreciate you coming. It's always nice to see. Uh, if you like the channel, remember to follow it. I'd really appreciate that. And well, you'll get cool content, so totally worth it. Okay, good night, everyone.